Hello everyone, I am Kavin Krishna Prasad from Informatica GCS. This is a part 1 video of data quality in CDGC where we will understand what is a data quality and how to achieve it in CDGC. The agenda for the today's session is what is a data quality, data quality terminology in CDGC and ways to achieve data quality in CDGC. In that, we will see all the options in details and the difference between them. Data quality is used to check the quality or the condition of data that is extracted into cloud data governance and catalog from the source system through the scanners. For instance, let's take an example of banking company which stores user related information such as name, contact number and address. As per the governance standards or norms, the data should contain certain values of format. Below are the few conditions that the data should have. Fields should not be null. Fields should have a certain fixed length. Fields should be unique. This kind of data quality checks can be achieved in CDGC using data quality options. Before we get started using data quality in CDGC, we need to be familiarized with few terminologies that we often use while creating DQ rules in CDGC. Primary data element and primary glossary. While creating the DQ rules in CDGC, the user has to select primary data element for a data quality rule occurrence which could be a column or field and primary glossary for a data quality rule template which is a business terms on which the data quality rule has to be executed. Technical rule reference. This is called as a rule specification or rule logic where the user will define set of conditions or rule on which the DQ rule has to be evaluated on the data element. Dimensions and measuring method. Dimensions and measuring methods are used for auditing purpose and those are like tagging a label to the DQ rule. These don't have any functionality behavior. You can select those based on your requirement. Also, the DQ rule will be by default evaluated on Informatica Cloud data quality. Target and threshold. Target is a minimum acceptable data quality value for the assert to be considered as good and the threshold is a minimum acceptable data quality value for the assert to be considered as acceptable. Frequency. Frequency of running data quality. This says how often the data quality rule has to be executed. The available frequencies are daily, weekly and monthly. Now let's see what are all the ways to achieve data quality in CDGC. There are three ways where we can achieve data quality in CDGC and they are data quality rule occurrence, data quality rule template and scorecard rule occurrence. Now let's see those rules in details, data quality rule occurrence. Data quality rule occurrence runs the DQ rule directly on technical data which is a column. Data quality rule occurrence uses the primary data element as a column. The user has to manually create a rule occurrence in data governance and catalog tool for the respective column. The user can use data quality rule occurrence if the business requirement is to check data quality rule on individual data elements. In CDGC, the DQ automation can be achieved using data quality rule template where it creates DQ rule occurrence automatically. Data quality rule template uses a primary data glossary as business term and the business term will be associated with relevant technical assets columns. The user can use rule template if the business requirement is to check the data quality on multiple similar column across the catalog sources. Let's take an example. There is a column called account number and this column is present over various catalog source. Now there is a requirement to run common DQ rule logic on the column account number. If you go ahead and create rule occurrence or then you need to create rule occurrence for all the columns manually. The recommended solution for this use case will be rule template because rule template creates rule occurrence automatically. Now you will get a questions about how it can create and how it will identify all the columns. The idea behind the rule template is it uses primary data element or a primary glossary as a business term and that business terms will be associated with all relevant columns across the catalog source. So now we'll have all the columns called account number under one entity called business term. Scorecard rule occurrence. The user can create a rule occurrence in cloud data profiling and that rule occurrence is called a scorecard rule occurrence. The scorecard rule occurrence created in cloud data profiling can be associated with the column directly in data governance and catalog. The user can display scorecard to the business users in data governance and catalog tool. The scorecard rule occurrence functionality is same as data quality rule occurrence in CDGC. The, the only difference is the runtime varies. In the upcoming video, we'll see how to create those data quality rules in CDGC along with live demonstration. We would love to hear from you. You can give your feedback through the link displayed on the screen. Thank you. Have a nice day.